At first glance, DT50 might appear to be a simple two-channel tube amp, and in some ways it is. It has all the characteristics of a classic boutique amplifier, an outstanding tube amp design from Reinhold Bogner, two 12AX7s running into two EL34s, and premium Celestion speakers, all the great analog components. It also operates exactly like you would expect a great tube amp to. All the knobs are WYSIWYG, so when you turn the amp on, they're all set exactly as they appear. Turn a knob and it stays until you move it again. Make a change to one of the switches and the backlight updates to let you know where you are. Nothing on the control panel changes unless you move it, so you're always in control of your sound. There's something much more advanced going on behind the scenes. DT50 allows you to select four voicings. So what's a voicing? It's the combination of analog component switching and digital signal processing. When you select a voicing, the HD modeling in DT50 adjusts to that particular sound. But that's not all. The analog components in the amp actually reconfigure as well to mirror a traditional setup for that sound. Voicing 1 is an American clean sound. Voicing 2 is a British crunch. Voicing 3 is a British chime. And voicing 4 is a modern high gain sound. You can assign any of these voicings to either of the two channels. So you can have two different voicings, or you can have two different variations of the same voicing. It doesn't end there. You can also select Class A or Class AB for each voicing, reconfiguring the power tube section instantly. Class A is traditionally more responsive and tends to break up quicker. Class AB generally offers more clean headroom and is more powerful. You can also select pentode or triode for each voicing, changing the mode of power tube operation. Pentode is big, loud, and bright sounding. Triode tends to have a more vintage sound, with lower volume and darker rounded mids. Both the Class A, Class AB switch and the pentode triode switch alter analog components and are completely independent of the DSP. All this lets you basically design your own personal dream amp on the fly, and you can create combinations that may have never even existed before. If you pull the master volume knob, you enter low power mode. In this mode, the DSP takes over a larger percentage of the tone, allowing you to get that full driven sound at a lower volume. As you turn the volume up, that percentage decreases and the analog components begin to take over. So DT50 is a simple two-channel tube amp at heart. It has all the great tone and inspiring feel of a classic tube amp, and the simplicity of operation you've come to expect. But if you care to look deeper, it'll offer up a whole new world of flexibility.